The MPC channel plugin from Harrison Audio is now available to anyone, whether you're in a home studio or a fully decked out full production facility. Check out the Harrison website for more information and take advantage of this amazing offer. The MPC channel is an all-in-one processing suite for post-production and music production. There are six different elements, including the EQ, filters, denoiser, de-esser, compressor, and rewritable sections. The window is resizable so you can see everything happening at a glance. It has fully automatable parameters and RTA displays. One of the key features of the MPC channel plugin is it's optimized for large format post-production needs. And it allows for hundreds of instances without negatively affecting your CPU performance. So whether you're working with audio or video, this would be a great addition to your production suite. The denoiser is based off of a noise reduction unit that came out many years ago and has been used on countless productions to get rid of extraneous noise that's just not needed. So this is an example of a recording I did on the car ride over here. And usually car noise is very low and it happened to be raining today. So let's hear what this sounds like with the plug-in off and then with the plug-in on. The MPC channel plug-in can help get rid of low noise rumble and other noise in the high end that could be a distraction in your dialogue. The MPC channel plug-in can help get rid of low noise rumble and other noise in the high end that could be a distraction in your dialogue. Here's another example of a family talking in the foyer and there's some extraneous noise out there and a lot of reverb. Here's with the plug-in off. <laughs> Here's with the plug-in on. So it's pretty nice to have that option when you need it to cut down on some of the noise. Maybe in your field recording, or maybe you're doing a podcast next to a noisy refrigerator, or just any other situation you might find yourself in. A great tool to use in any production are high and low pass filters. The filters in the MPC channel plugin can go from 20 hertz all the way up to 20K. So this allows us to hone in on just the low end or the high end of any source to find any problem areas that we might want to cut out. So I'm going to experiment a little bit on this guitar part and hear how much high end information I can really hear. And that lets me know how much top end I can actually take off. So let's roll the low pass all the way up and actually turn it off. And let's use the high pass filter to determine how much high end information there is. All right, so I actually stopped hearing it at about 10K but there's probably an area between five and 10K where we can start rolling it off nice and smooth. Okay, let's do the opposite on the low end now. Let's take the low pass filter and roll it all the way down. Little rumble in that 70 hertz. But a lot of this area is going to be taken up by the kick drum and the bass guitar. So we don't need as much low end on a guitar part as you think you do. So with that knowledge, let's go ahead and do about 7K on the guitar. Let's bring the high pass filter up to about 100 hertz. Now let's listen to it and plug it off and on. And you can actually assign a shelf to one of the high bands and boost it just a little bit.
So that way we can cut out the high part that we don't need, but still accentuate the part that sounds good in a mix. Once again, check out harrisonaudio.com to grab this amazing deal. And until next time, I'm Nathan from Harrison Audio. I'll see you in the next video.